and there was no NA meetings there, and, uh, and, and Joyce came to us, it was the 6.30 a.m. Uh, AA meeting, and, um, and I would share, you know, and uh, what kind of drugs I did, and what kind of drugs I'm going to do, and this and that, and, uh, and the old, old A timers would just tell me, you know, please don't do that, you know, and, uh, and I would growl at them, you know, and I was very angry when I first got here, you know, and, uh, and Joyce would come in, and she, and she sat next to me and introduced herself to me, and, and she said, you know, these, these people want, want to help you, you know, and, uh, and when, that, when I heard that, you know, I just, like, my, my, my heart kind of, like, softened up a little bit, you know, and, uh, you know, because, you know, uh, where we come from, the men and, and the women, where we come from, the drugs and the usage and the drinking in the, in the streets of Long Beach, you know, and uh, I was born and raised here, and, um, and she, uh, she, would, she would tell me, it doesn't matter where you came from or what you did, it's what you want to do now. And uh, those were the first words of recovery that I heard in AA from a, from a woman, you know, and, and I met another woman, uh, Tony LaRue, and she became my sponsor for 10 years. So you, you hear a lot of controversy about men sponsoring women and women sponsoring men, and, but, uh, you know, what it is, what it is, you know, and uh, I'm just really grateful that she was a friend in my life, you know, and she would come over to once, once a year, once, uh, whether it would be Christmas or Thanksgiving, she would come to our house, and I have five kids, and, and, uh, she, and this is my youngest son, Dustin, and, uh, and, you know, and she would hold him and stuff like that, you know, and uh, really going to miss her, and, and, and my condolences to the family and the loved ones. Thank you. Thank you.